Hi, baby. All right. So welcome this evening. I am so glad to be with you guys tonight. I missed you. I know I never missed a rally or anything like that, but I was kind of on vacation mentally. Uh, you know what that is. Uh, lots of time with grandbabies and lots of time with family, which is always good for everybody, right? I hope you did something really fun this weekend. Uh, it was a nice holiday weekend, right? Uh, nice time. And so tonight we are going to pop around really quick. Um, I wanted to do hot tips, uh, tips from the top. And so we, I've got to cover a few things, but also I want to make sure that um, you guys know that at 8.30, we're jumping off of here and jumping on uh, to the national uh, record uh, level up workshop that um, our regional Peter, our, our president Peter and our regionals are doing. And so it's pretty important workshop, okay? And um, Dora is going to be doing drawings. Now the drawings won't be announced on that call. She'll do them afterwards from everybody that was on. So I'll be making a list and we'll be making sure, check, checking it twice. So when you're on, you need to say, I'm here with champion so that you can be in the drawings, okay? Because we want to give you a chance to win. Dora's fun stuff, all right? And so speaking of winning, Jenny, let's give something away. We have um, uh, last week's meeting that was so fun. Uh, were you on last week where we were looking for success? That was my granddaughter when she was, uh, that picture that was up there. I don't have that up here tonight, but uh, that was her when she was like six years old. She's like 15 now. So Jenny, let's give it away from last week's rally. Peggy Merritt. All right, Peggy. Peggy. <laughs> she just got done thanking me for last week's gift. She won week. twice last week. So. Yeah, exactly. Good job, Peggy. You're a winning machine, I'll tell you. Well, um, tonight's level up is going to be led by our president and regionals. And so I really want to encourage you to get on there tonight. And that will start at 8.30. So we'll go from one meeting to the other. Um, the other thing I want to do is talk to you about all the leaders. If you're not a leader yet, you want to step up to be a leader because every single Thursday morning we get together for about 30 minutes. Um, and if it runs over, it runs over. You're allowed to get off. It doesn't matter. But the reason we get together is because we want to pick each other's brains. We're going to build each other. And uh, today's ahas was on there. And if you are not able to get on leaders, you're in your um, in your texting group that we have, the TW leaders, um, you will find the link there, always the recording there. So you can go there and listen to it and still comment on the uh, chat. Uh, what you loved about it. So thank you for those that did that. And it's all leaders all the way at, through directors can be on that. And let's just share and build each other up in that a half an hour, 40 minutes and get ourselves updated to what we need to know for the week. And so um, why do you love leadership is what we were asking you to share today. And so thank you for doing that. Jenny, go ahead and do the drawing. Drawing on that is Melissa Kelly. Melissa Kelly, congratulations, Melissa. All right. All right. So, um, and share the shine. That's the one we want to do. And I want to tell you, talking about share the shine, this hit home with me uh, when I read this. And I thought, I love the way they even po posted this. It hit home with me too. When a flashlight dims, gr uh, lights grows dim or quits working, do you just throw it away? Of course not. You change the batteries. When a person... Uh, messes up or finds himself in the dark place, do you um, cast them out? <laughs> of course not. You help them change their batteries. And so some need a double A, attention and affection. Some need a triple A, attention, affection, and acceptance. And some need a C, compassion. And some need D, direct. And if they still don't shine, Simply sit with them quietly and share their light and share your light with them. Isn't that beautiful? And so sharing the shine at Champion is very important. And I want to thank each and every one of you that do that. I want to thank you for always um, cross-training as leaders and uh, from the directors uh, in the leadership team. And so let's just talk about Share the Shine. We had some really good ones this week. And then tonight we're going to share our shine on uh, some of the leaders that are going to share this evening. And so let's start um, by giving away a drawing for last week's Share the Shine. Go ahead. Okay. It is Don Jameson. Don Jameson. Oh, Don. Yay. Congratulations, Don. All right. And so we have um, some things coming up, but I want to just touch base. 
there's going to be a big sale that starts tomorrow. Make sure you're looking at that. And that's the, I think they called it clean the house sale or something like that. Cleaning, uh, cleaning sale. So these are pretty cute, aren't they? <laughs> these little canisters. I didn't want you to miss how cute these were. So I wanted to put them up there and I'm sure they're probably going to add in some other of our, um, our, our towels and so forth like that. So be watching for that. Today started this sale. Boy, that was fun. Everything but the turkey. <laughs> I thought that was so cute. And so um, I love our corkscrew. Do you guys not love that corkscrew? It's so fun. You like to use it twice. <laughs> um, and then our cookware, thebomb.com. And if you notice there, the Ultra Pro two quart casserole uh, pan with cover, oh, $57. That is going to go like crazy in the ham keeper. Another huge bonus for only $18. That is awesome. My goodness, I think I bought that in 1970 for $18. So that is a really, really good price. Um, and so if you know anybody that loves that cookware, make sure you're getting the information out to them. Leaders, um, your meeting this morning was with me, but tomorrow you have your monthly meeting with Dora and that is at noon tomorrow. So make sure you get on that. And then Monday night, we're going to have a record breaker workshop with the region. And that is with Dora and all of the, all the business leaders. We have trainers from Champion, trainers from all over. And boy, oh boy, do we have some top-notch trainers in our region. You're going to want to be on this. Uh, uh, it starts at Monday at seven to nine. It's a longer one because there is so much to cover for Record Breaker. There is also recognition and that is personal recruiting, personal sales, unit sales, team sales, and organizational sales. So yay. Um, and buy your raffle tickets. The link is up there for you to buy. I put it on the champion team page and um, the raffles are, we're going to give all of this stuff away uh, if we collect enough money, which I think we will. I don't think it's, but it is based on how much money we collect. And so somebody's going to win all the samples. Somebody wins a laptop. Hello, Peggy. Peggy won a laptop at one of the <laughs> events with us. Uh, somebody's going to win a folding wagon, uh, HP printer, and we're going to give away Amazon gift cards. And so it's really going to be quite fun. This is a fun one. You never want to miss the regional meeting like this because it's so fun. And it's a regional record breaker workshop. Then next week, all week, there's going to be a training on the uh, Blue Fire Regions page. So you're going to want to find it every single day. We will forward it also to the champion page. Um, but you want to make sure you don't miss those trainings that are going to be held across the, um, the entire region. All right. Um, and then uh, Tuesday night, there's going to be Level Up Taste of Royalty. If you want to go or you want to earn the $750 voucher, or if you want to go on the royalty trip as a director, we're asking you to be on this call. And that is Tuesday the 12th. And it starts um, obviously at 8.30 um, Eastern time. All right. And so um, we still have the four kits that just started. Okay. And so we have a $49 kit, $109 kit, oh, $99 kit, $109 kit, and a $129 kit. And the first order award is uh, a choice and they can choose between um, their uh, Fridge Smart or that beautiful fridge set. Guys, I have to tell you something really exciting. They released a first order award, Better Together. I'm sorry, Better Together Consistency Challenge for September. And so the first level is the stack cooker. And then next month in October and then November is another gift. And then the consistency is there as well. Wow. So they're going to do it again. And so all of your recruits that come in this month, when they place their $250 order in their first um, 30 days, they will um, get the also the $75 voucher. Um, and so that all is explained on here. And you follow the arrows. And so they take their first order award, and then they have, schedule that party, and they can get hostess gifts and host awards. And then when they have at least $100 in um, their first 30 days, or $500 in their first 30 days, they will get the $75 voucher or the $150 voucher. And then come down here, because if they do $250 by the end of the month, which is um, September, the I think it's the 29th. Um, my eyes aren't that good. I think it's September the 29th, the end of the month. Um, but it's the last day of September, they will get the stack cooker and get into the program for Better Together. Now you have to do it and they have to do it. 
And they also continue with the 13 week program, which is all of the extra bonuses. All of these are free. This is only $5 each month. This is free. Um, this is of course uh, free as a host. Um, and this is $20 choice. So my goodness. Now I have to be honest with you. I like to keep it simple. And so my way of keeping it simple is um, this, all right? Um, this is what we did last month. And I will have one. I've already got one made up for this month. I pulled the wrong one. But I will also tell you that what Tupperware decided to do is because they had so many recruits in the last week of last month that they decided to give all of the recruiters in the month of August a second chance. And so the second chance is going to be go ahead and continue um, with your um, September gift, which is the glass product. And you'll continue with your October gift, which is those canisters. And if you missed uh, your August gift, they're going to give you another chance in November and still be able to qualify for the consistency. Isn't that awesome? Pretty cool, I think. Uh, pretty, pretty amazing. All right. And so recruiting award. Uh, when you have a recruit last week, you got this for only $3. This week is this little guy, the pink one, my favorite color. All right. And so if you get a recruit this week, you're going to get the pink uh, beautiful water bottle. And then they'll have one for next week and also the following week and the bonus award when you welcome one new recruit each week in September uh, who submit $100 and, and orders, you'll get all to both of these for $18. The two-week challenge that you have uh, for the last week and this week is this gorgeous um, set. You get one for every $500 sold. And then this is your sales challenge at $2,500 and the beautiful swing bag for $5 thousand. Also your consistency when you do a thousand last month and a thousand this month. And we had like 30 of you that did that. Congratulations. Um, and go ahead and get it this month. You're going to get the um, beautiful piece of oven works for only um, ultra pro for only $12. And this is challenge from Gemini. And this is your challenge that if you <laughs> have one recruit in the first two weeks of September and have a thousand dollars in sales, you get this from Pam and Jim for free. Who loves free? Go ahead, put it in the chat. I love free. Free is for me. All right. All right. So let's stop our share right now. And we're going to jump to um, Loretta. And Loretta is going to share a little bit with you about hot tips. Thank you, Loretta. So, um, yeah, I did a, a vendor event. Well, I did my, my county fair this weekend. And I just wanted to share a quick little tip that I did. Um, so I have to share my screen so you can see my picture. So I had the uh, entry kit. Starter kit, they call it the set starter kit. Why can't I share? Here it is, hold on, uh, here we go. All right, so I had the, um, I have a center table and on my center table, I had the starter kit, which is the junior that's a bowl and the measuring cups and spoons and the spatula and the uh, supersonic compact chopper, all right? So of course, everyone picks up the chopper. It's right there in the front. Oh, by the way, I also have the cookware. I have the eight inch frying pan on display, okay? Huge attention grabber, lots of questions, er, lots of people interested, okay? Um, so anyway, um, I had that kit there. So they're loving the chopper and they're like, well, how much is it? And I'm like, well, it's $50, okay? Also, on my in my display where I actually had my products for sale, I had the chopper all by itself, right? And I had this sign. So I had two signs on cardstock, um, right next to the little mini chopper. And it just happened to be right next to the measuring cups and the spatula, <laughs> the junior bowl, all right there, okay? So in two places, but anyway, so they could read it themselves. And I'm telling you, I had people just say, I want that. I'm like, okay, wait, whoa, <laughs> okay. Um, Cause right, this or that, you want the little chopper for $50 or for only $49, $158 value, you're gonna get um, a one-year membership ask about awards too, okay? So then- that was an attention grabber. And so I could bring them in that way um, and, and kind of share with them. So they signed up right on the spot. I had my tablet there. And so they would just sign themselves up. I told them they're on my mailing list or email list. However, they wanted to communicate with the sales specials and, and they could get their discount for a year. And they're going to get a party link so that um, if their friends and family want to order off their website, they could even make some money, all right? But it started with that little mini chopper. So that worked for me. I think I got five recruits um, uh, signed up and ready to go. So that was exciting. OMG, that is very exciting. So are you gonna share that with us, Loretta? Oh, share the sign. I'll put it out there as soon as we're done. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, thank you, Loretta. Thank you. You're so good at making uh, creative signs and also easy uh, to read signs. So too many words, people walk away. And yeah. so you've got to make them simple. And so that people can look at it at a glance and read it on a glance, because okay. if they're, if there's too much, they won't. All right. And next we want to talk to, um, I believe uh, Robin wants to share with us. So Robin Vanderwagen, Robin, how much did you sell last week? Um, last week I sold $1,525. Um, so just, I, I had gone live last night on champion and I know some people have already seen it. So I, um, just wanted to do a, a short recap of some of the things that I said, uh, that helped me to bring in extra sales. The one thing is we had that end of summer sale and we're going to be coming up to the time where we have the pre black Friday sale and the black Friday sale. So we're going to see those items that were on sale earlier in the year at a little bit less than than even the sale price which is always nice for our customers so one thing because we that happens you know we get that going on several times a year i do keep a list in the back of my um my party book i keep a list of what people are are interested in on my facebook page i do part uh on my business page and my vip page i post the sales and um uh, sometimes people will delete them after the sale has ended. I never do because you always get somebody who misses the boat, even though you say, I always say on my posts when it ends, um, they miss the boat and they want it two days after it ended. I write those things down. I, I If there's a comparable substitute, I might, you know, talk them into something else, but most, more often than not, I write it down on my look for page and um, I put their name and they're looking, whatever it is that they're looking for. If they were after the fix and mix bowl or if they were after um, the vent and serves, whatever it is, I write that down. And then the next time, you know, and I say, Hey, I'll keep my eyes open. Next time it comes up, uh, I, I message them. And that's, that it just keeps me on my toes and it get, gets me, keeps me in constant contact with these people, which is kind of nice. The other thing, um, and, and this was, I'm, I'm sure a tip given to us many times by many different people, but at my vendor events, I take, um, you know, I do the, the contact form. I usually have a drawing with it. So they, I put a little extra place at the bottom, put your guests here. So they fill it out for the, um, for the drawing, but I know it was suggested to me to write something on it, you know, to, to remember them if they had, you know, if they were expecting, or if they were talking about moving soon or whatever it is, I'll write those notes on the back. And then I keep these forever. I never throw them out. Um, but I do go through and I, if there's something notable, I'll put it in my notebook. But um, on this one, it says, this person would like to get some more Tupperware, maybe have a party. Uh, she has not yet had a party, so I have her on the top of my pile so that I can contact her and see if she indeed would like to have a party. I had another one of somebody that was moving and was looking to get more Tupperware. So I keep those little notes, and that's very helpful. Um, my last thing about the, uh, the, the people looking for different products whenever you know we are our, our, the sales kind of rotate through we, this goes on sale you know our our modular mates are on sale a couple times a year and stuff like that um whenever i if i haven't written it down if it wasn't something somebody was looking for you can easily do a facebook search so i will go onto facebook do a search for modular mates and uh, maybe i'll use some a, a more detailed search of, of a verbiage that I like to use when I'm talking about modular mates. And then I will filter that to my posts. And then I can look for the last, however many years I've been doing this two slightly over two years. I can look at all the posts that I made about modular mates, read the comments. And then those are contacts. Those are people that I can say, Hey, you know, the modular mates are going on sale. Maybe it's somebody that bought some, of course you can search your orders for that too, but you can search those comments on your Facebook so easily and I did put a little video on how to do that so that, um, you know, on the champion page. So if you're interested, I think it ended up turning up, turning into a reel. But if you're interested in knowing how to search your previous posts so that you can look at those comments and get um, more contacts, people that, that might be interested in that product, let me know. Check it out on, on champion. Um, I think that's all I have. So oh I have more. But... So smart. So smart. Robin, thank you. That was very, 
very thoughtful you for you to go live yesterday and share it with us because you knew it worked for you. My goodness, I have $1,500 in personal sales in a week with only one party. A lot of that was just orders coming in. So that's huge. That's awesome. Congratulations. Really proud of you, Robin, and very thankful to have you at Champion. All right. And so next we're going to jump over to our um, Melissa. Melissa, are you ready? I'm here. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. When you talk, they can find you and, and yeah, <laughs> jump me up there. Mm -hmm. Um, so I am an adult survivor of ADHD. Um, I have to write everything down. So a few months ago I was doing some searching on how to organize myself better. I'm one of those people. I have to go to the grocery store with a list because if not I'm buying $500 of stuff and I'm saying what am I going to do with this so what I did was and I'll I think I sent this to Pam but I'll resend it to anybody that could post it up because I've got it on an excel and I'm not exactly sure how to do that but I created a list um, of everything and I'm hoping this isn't flipping backwards on everybody but this is just everything that I need to do on a on a daily basis, check my email. This is my VIP Facebook group, um, what I need to do for Instagram and TikTok, what I need to do for my clients, what I need to do in my back office, my upline, um, my team Facebook page, my calendar, and um, Tup Social. And you'll see, I just do Tup Social once a week because you can um, post it out several days. So I just do it every Monday for the entire week. So I just put X's so they don't try to repeat it. Um, this is an older one when I first started. So you can see I kind of dropped out on Tuesday, um, but I still try to do this every day. But by having this visual reminder sitting right on my desk, it tells me exactly what I need to do um, and on what days I need to do it. Um, another thing that I do is if I have vendor shows scheduled um, or parties, I will write it down along, like if I've got a vendor show on a Saturday, I'll write vendor show and where is that so that I know that I've got that going. Um, so I hope this helps. I will send it out. Um, it said it's in Excel. So if you need to um, have a copy of it, I'll make sure that somebody gets it. Thanks guys. Wow, I love that idea. And I know lots of other people love that idea too. Thank you for sharing. All right, and so we have four minutes and we need to jump on the other um, event. And so um, I think that, um, let me just share that link right here so nobody has to go looking for it. Um, oh, thank you, Jenny Cheatham, you're rocking awesome. So guys, copy that right now. And then you're gonna put that in the link and get on now because uh, it's starting with Peter. So we wanna start with Peter. I am going to go live this evening and do recognition when it's all over, okay? So I'll be doing the recognition live on the uh, uh, Champion Facebook page. Bye, guys. Get on.